bites and you can't taste nothing. You gotta get better at that. But mom, it is one cookie. I be a big girl. It won't fit in my mouth. Yes, it would. Now <laughs> shove it in there. You are like stinking. Yeah. You can't tell the players. Hey designers and welcome back. We're here for another taste test. Yep. You ready to eat some food? Yes. Alright, you guys stick around. So I've been having fun with these, have you? So so. <laughs> I think it's been fun because I never have thought I had really much of a palate. Have you? No. Some people can take a bite of like say a pasta sauce and tell you every herb that's in there. I can't do that. Not this cat. Yeah, I can't either. It's like I can't really pick out different tastes. I can only just tell you if I like it or don't. That's right. <laughs> and we have discovered that through these last couple taste tests. We're not real good about picking out what we're eating. No. Nah. <laughs> so anyway, we're here with another one. Baby Girl has been to the store yet again. And I know, I know, all of you guys keep asking for the kids to be on this side of the camera. We're working on it. Trying. <laughs> but they are refusing, you guys. And of course, I'm not going to force them to do it. I will. You <laughs> well, we will have to see how that goes. But nonetheless, we are working on it. Maybe we can get them back here. Maybe we can't. But she's been to the store. Hopefully, she's taking it easy on us. We have no idea what's happening. So, babe, is there a theme? Yes. All right. There's a theme. There was a theme last week. Yeah. It was all Mexican candy. So what's the theme this week? It's all the same thing, just different flavors. Okay, so it's the same type of food, just different flavors of this food. So we can't tell, we don't know if it's a candy, dessert, cracker, whatever. All right, so she's not giving up on this one. Next time we can do coffees. New. <laughs> You would like that. I hate coffee. Ugh. Poison. All right. Huh? Poison. <laughs> so let's get our blindfold on and see what we got this time. So we are blindfolded up and ready to go, guys. You got number one ready? There you go. How many, how many are there? Four. Four. Okay. Cookie. Did you already bite it? You're supposed to wait on me. Sorry. Crunchy like a cookie. Yeah, I don't like that. That tastes like a shortbread cookie inside, but but a but a little sweeter than a shortbread. Covered in chocolate. Is that what your guess is? Yeah. Yeah, and that's it. That kind of tastes like a cookie that would come out around Christmas time. It tastes like a cheap cookie. Yeah, cheap cookie at Christmas time. Did you like that one? It was all right. Nothing stellar. Okay, so we're ready with number two. Feels the exact same way. Did you even give us a different brand? I think those taste very similar. The first one was a little more shortbread-y, but those taste pretty similar. Mm, not my favorite either. Is your guess that it is some kind of chocolate covered cookie? I gotta have some water, that's not real good. All right, so here we go with number three. Okay, now this feels very different. Delicate, dear, delicate. Delicate. You ready to bite? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think. Yeah. Ew. No. Mm -mm. Are these foreign cookies? That almost tastes like that has. Does that have a coconut to the top? I usually like coconut, but I'm getting like a slight taste of coconut. Mm -mm. I did not like that. Did you? I haven't liked any of them yet. Ew, that's the worst one so far. No. Not liking that. That has a bad aftertaste. Alright, so here we go with number four. This feels like an Oreo. You're not ready again. Mm. You're too eager. 
Tastes like an Oreo, just a little different. Let me take it apart. Because I can't tell that that, I don't think that cookie is an Oreo cookie. It tastes like a chocolate cookie that's supposed to be like an Oreo cookie. You have to eat the whole thing because there's it's something in the middle. But Mom, it is one cookie. I be a big girl. It won't fit in my mouth. No, it would. No, shove it in there. Are you put the whole thing in your mouth? What? Are you put the whole thing in your mouth? It's gone. Did you figure it out? It's just a cookie. Okay. Hmm? I said it was okay. It was probably the best one. Mm-hmm. Too crunchy though. This is definitely the best out of four. Mm-hmm. I have no idea what it is, but it does taste good. But I don't know if it is an Oreo. No, it's not an Oreo, it's something like it. The cookie itself didn't necessarily taste like the Oreo cookie. <clears throat> but that's very good. Definitely my favorite out of all four. So, was that the last one, guys? Yeah. We can take the blindfolds off? Yeah. Yes. Alright, before we find out what they were, I gotta get a quick drink. That's rough. Even when you're only taking one bite of something, it's like this mad sugar rush. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. So we're gonna find out what these were. All these were cookies. Yes. Yes. And babe, were these all foreign again like last week? All but one. All but one. All right, so we tasted some more foreign food. All right, so let's find out what was number one. What was that first one we ate that was kind of like a shortbread? Carmelo cookies. The Carmelo cookies. All right, so that's what that looks like. These were not bad. I mean, that was that was okay if you like a shortbread kind of taste. Where are these from? Poland. Okay, so these are from Poland. Your your grandpa, was it grandma or grandpa that was from Poland? And my grandfather. Yeah, I think grandpa was from Poland and your grandma was from Czechoslovakia. So there you go, some Polish food. All right, what was number two? Chocolate obsession with strawberry. Chocolate obsession with strawberry. I did not taste any strawberry in that cookie. Did you? It was very similar to the first one, but I actually thought the first one was a little better than this. Yeah, definitely. Where, where's this one from? Poland. Oh, this is from Poland again. Okay. <laughs> All right, so that was the same brand, and I didn't even notice that on the box. Did you? <laughs> it looks similar, but... All right, so what was number three? Arcorius. Arcorius marshmallow cookies. These were disgusting. These were nasty. See if you can figure out where those are from. They got a cute look to them. I mean, I didn't see it in person. It felt cute, looks cute on the package, but these were nasty. Where are they from? Mexico. Oh, these are from Mexico. Didn't care for these, did you? No. <laughs> no, I didn't like that one. That was the worst out of all of those. All right, and what was the last one? The last one's the one we did like. What was the last one? I'm surprised, you know, the last couple of taste tests, we've actually agreed. Surprising. <laughs> Chocolate strawberry Oreos. Chocolate strawberry Oreos. I didn't taste the strawberry though. I didn't taste the strawberry. And I didn't think it was an Oreo. It was a little crunchier. I didn't taste the strawberry in this. I didn't even. I didn't even think it tasted like an Oreo because an Oreo, the cookie part has a distinct flavor. I didn't think it tasted like an Oreo, but I did think it was good. Like I thought it was the lit. What Oreo isn't good? I mean, be real. Have you ever had an Oreo that was bad? Yeah. You have? What kind of Oreo you ever had that was bad? Orange. I like the orange Oreos. <laughs> These were good. Well, I would have to taste that again now that I know it's strawberry to see if I could pick up on the strawberry. But did you taste the strawberry? I didn't taste it. I didn't either. All right, well that was fun. I've been enjoying these taste tests, have you? I can handle them. Yeah, these are the fun kind. <laughs> they did good. And I do like that they picked us up some foreign stuff because I've never really tasted much foreign stuff before except just a few of the recipes that your grandma your grandma did cook yeah. she cooked us a few things that were like traditional from where they were from but other than that so that was fun baby you did good you did a good job two weeks in a row she's done a good job so i can handle these if they if they stay like this That's right <laughs> all right well i want to thank you all so very much for joining us hopefully you're having as much fun with these as we are and now you'll know what kind of goodies to go find and what you might want to leave behind so we want to remind you all that you are created for purpose so go and be all you can be we'll see you soon in the next video